welcome to the channel today we are going to balance this reaction look at here this is copper this is nitric acid this is copper nitrate this is nitrogen dioxide and this is water okay to balance this reaction we have to draw a table like this this is reactant site and this is product site so now we need to count the number of atoms from both sides okay in the left hand side we have here copper which is one then here we have hydrogen one look no3 is a polyatomic ion which is one in the right hand side look we have copper then we have no3 that is polyatomic ion nitrate ion which is two right and then look we have nitrogen dioxide that is we have more nitrogen so for the presence of this nitrogen we will break down this polyatomic ion right separately look so we have look we have one hydrogen then we have here nitrogen which is one then we have oxygen here which is three so in the right hand side we have copper one then we have nitrogen these two applies for all right okay so we have nitrogen two right two here the subscript of nitrogen is one so one times two that gives you two then here oxygen number of oxygen here will be look three times two six look here we have more one nitrogen so let me add here so basically we are getting three nitrogen then here we have two oxygen so let me add here then here we have one more oxygen so we are getting total nine and here we have hydrogen that is two okay to balance this reaction means we have to balance the number of copper hydrogen nitrogen and oxygen from both side look copper one one copper is already balanced but hydrogen here one but here two so hydrogen is not balanced so to balance the hydrogen what can i do i can easily multiply here by two that gives me two so two two is balanced so look if you multiply by something that something must come before that atom so these two will come before this atom as a coefficient this hydrogen has come from here so we have to place here these two right we have to place here these two okay if you place here two the number of hydrogen will be two the number of nitrogen will be two so let me update my number of nitrogen the number of oxygen will be three times two that is six so let me update my oxygen which is six okay so look hydrogen two to hydrogen is balanced look now we need to balance nitrogen two here but here three okay look this three is a odd number right and this is a even number okay to balance this nitrogen what can i do look i can multiply here by three that gives me six and i can multiply here by two that gives me six look if you multiply here by two these two must come before this nitrogen look so we have to place these two before this nitrogen as a coefficient so these two must come here or here you can't decide actually where where is the right position of two right because this nitrogen may come from here or here so since this nitrogen is uh, it has probability to come more than one uh, compound so we need to adopt we need to be strategic to balance right so so will not uh, proceed in this way so what can i do look 
now we will apply what to event technique look here uh, 3 is a odd number we need to make it even but look here 1 is a odd number so to make it even I can multiply here by 2 so this oxygen has come from here right 1 this 1 oxygen has come from here and this 2 oxygen has come from here uh, sorry this uh, this one this one nitrogen has come from here and this two nitrogen has come from here so since this one is a odd number so we li would like to convert this one into even number by multiplying two so these two must come before this oxygen that is here if i place here two the number of nitrogen will be two so here already we have two and here we have two so basically we are getting here four right and this four is a even number okay so if you place here two the number of nitrogen is two the two four then the number of oxygen here two times two that is four right so let me update my number of oxygen here okay four right two times two four six okay so we are getting here totally 11 oxygen right look hydrogen here two but here two hydrogen is balanced nitrogen here two but here four so to balance the nitrogen what can i do i can easily multiply here by two that gives me four so these two must come before this nitrogen that is here so look two into two that gives me four so let me write four if i place here four the number of hydrogen will be four so let me here we have two so let me update my number of hydrogen that is i'm getting four the number of nitrogen will be four already we have the number of oxygen will be three times four that is 12 right actually this is not uh, hard right easy 12 so look our copper one one is balanced but hydrogen four here two so our hydrogen is not balanced to balance the hydrogen i can multiply here by two that gives me four these two must come before this hydrogen that is here so we have to place here two if i place here two the number of hydrogen will be four and the number of oxygen here will be two so i have to change this number right so i have to write here two so if i add then i will get totally 12 oxygen so oxygen 12 12 so oxygen is balanced nitrogen 4 4 nitrogen is balanced and hydrogen 4 4 hydrogen is balanced and copper 1 or copper is balanced so everything is balanced so you can say that this is the balanced equation at last you can change this arrow sign with equal sign right okay this is the balanced equation I hope believe and expect that uh, you have understood what I want to say to you. So thank you for being this video. Be well.